Hi, this is Carl from World Party, and this is Buzzine. I thought the other week about just trying to wanting to open a kind of record store that was just LPs and having the turntables on the till, you know, like so that you could just sit there with a friend and listen to the headphones. Like, you know, the album was sadly missed. And, uh, you know, with this diary and CD stuff, it just seemed like a nice way of including a lot of things to just look at and get lost in, you know. So and apart from that, it, it was like a utility thing as well. You can we had this thing at home, Redstone Diaries, they make really nice books and uh, I basically thought, what a great way of, of, you know, sticking some CDs inside and just giving somebody s s something useful, you know, to have with it. Because box sets and things, you always, where do you put them? They always come in some strange box and it fits next to the maps or something on the bookshelves, you know what I mean? Like, it's just a strange thing, you know. But that was my kind of homespun attempt at making something interesting, you know. I got time on my hands. I mean, I've never thought of this as a sort of retro band. I never wanted to have a bouffant hairdo or, you know what I mean? I never wanted to back comb the top of my hair and wear sort of Carnaby Street clothes or whatever. I've always thought of just continuing something, really. So it's never been like a retro thing to me. On this album, there's lots of different kinds of music anyway. It's not really one genre, which has always been our, one of our problems, actually. We've never been able to be marketed at any particular target audience, you know? So it's just music, really. It's just stuff what I do in my studio, you know what I mean? I'm just pretty lucky to go and indulge in thinking of something and then going and recording it, you know, and luckily seem to have done a sort of enough of a job to have like, you know, spent my last sort of 30 years or whatever it is, you know, doing this. So um, I just feel sort of lucky really, you know, in a way.